What we have here are some cover crops that were planted in the middle of July with the objective of growing a lot of biomass and then allowing it to frost kill. The advantage to this is that it leaves a mulch in place at the end of winter so that a farmer can plant early spring vegetable crops without tillage. So many of the systems that have been studied and researched and developed and utilized involve either an overwinter cover crop, which is suitable for May and June planting of vegetables, or an early summer cover crop, which is mowed or rolled about this time of year for late summer and fall crops. And what this opens up is the possibility of planting no-till peas, onions, spinach, lettuce, early broccoli, early cabbage um, in the early spring. Another advantage of this system is you're not depending on being able to mechanically kill. That means that farmers who are operating on a small scale with limited resources and only have uh, a limited range of equipment don't have to worry about how am I going to mow or roll this thing down so it won't come back because the winter will take care of it.